Hi, I'm Debbie Dalrymple, and today I'm going to show you how to change a number to a long date format using Excel. When you type in Excel, Excel chooses the formatting for the cell according to what you've typed. So if you type in letters, Excel chooses a text format. If you type in a short date, like 1 slash 2 slash 2014, Excel chooses a short date. Even though Excel makes these choices initially, you have control to change them. So I'm going to show you how to change a number format that Excel has selected into a long date. So we're going to take a look at how to change a short date into a long date. Today we're using Excel 2013. However, the technique is exactly the same in Excel 2010. Here in cell A3, you see I have a date, January 2nd, 2014. It's in the short date format. In order to change it to the long date format, I'm going to right click on the cell and then choose Format Cells. In the Format Cells dialog box, I'm going to choose from the date category, the long date format. The long date format is the one that spells out the name of the day and the name of the month. Selecting that format, I'm then going to click OK. And you'll notice in my document, the day of the week and the month are now spelled out. In cell A1, I also have a number that is actually a date, but has been converted to the number format, as you'll see here on the home ribbon. I can use the same technique to turn this into the long date format. Right click, choose Format Cells, change the category to date, choose the format you wish, click the OK button. So that's how you use Microsoft Excel to change a number to a long date format.